We thank you tonight. We're also getting an update on the search for Winston Salem's next police chief. So far, about 70 people have applied. It's about two weeks from now, and the city will be narrowing that list down from 70 plus to the top 15. As Louis Tran also reports for us, a grassroots organization met with the community tonight to talk about the process. We have a couple of internal applicants. A conversation about selecting the new Winston-Salem police chief. An organization called Hope Dealers Outreach in the city of Winston-Salem gave people a chance at the meeting and on Instagram Live to ask questions about the process. How could we kind of like really inform our community? Including Michael Banner, who wanted to educate his community about it. Our community is so ill-informed about the processes of the police department. And that's why president of Hope Dealers Outreach, Ethan King, tells me he wants to bridge the gap between people and officers. He says both sides need to work together. We show our community to say, hey, the system is not all as bad as it, as it seems. There, there are some in place. They are working to improve. To build trust between both sides, Winston-Salem Assistant City Manager Patrice Tony says she wanted to hear what people had to say. She says there's a shortage of officers right now and the department needs more help. Having a safe and secure community is one of the highest priorities of our city. It impacts um, businesses, it impacts communities. We want people to feel safe where they live in their neighborhoods, but most importantly in their interactions with our police officers. To make that happen, Banner encourages everyone, both police and residents, to actively listen. A strong trait, he says, he hopes the new chief will have. As long as the person is willing to communicate, you know what I'm saying, in equal terms, I feel confident that we can, we can make something happen that's, that's good for the community. And again, that was Louis Tran reporting. So 70 plus candidates now that'll be narrowed down to 15. Then on December 15th, I'll narrow it down to the final three in January. At that time, they'll hold a community meeting to get input on those final few candidates. Winston-Salem's current police chief, Katrina Thompson, is stepping down next month. She's been nominated to serve the state of North Carolina as a U.S. Marshal. Well,